Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Camilla Ritter Yule, Thomas Leiburn, Denmark. And on my left, Lee Young Dai, Ha Young Geun, Korea. Ladies and gentlemen, a very warm welcome Camilla here from Mülheim an der Ruhr. Badminton Europe no. TV will bring you live pictures from the Onyx German Open 2012. We will of course cover all five finals today. And we're starting with the mixed doubles, where Lee Yong Dae, Ha Jung Oin of Korea face Thomas Leibon and Camilla Yule of Denmark. The Danes got a quick lead. Chulov, Camilla Yule to serve. Good start for Denmark. <laughs> Thomas Leber and Camilla Yule are currently number eight in the world rankings. Thomas is 34 years old, Camilla is 28. And they are seeded as number four here in Germany. They are today's opponents. Lee Yong Dae, Ha Jung Eun of Korea are uh, world number seven. <laughs> Lee Yong Dae is the current Olympic champion in the mixed doubles and is a real superstar in Korea. Interesting note that both pairings have never played against each other. So it's the first time actually they met. Five, one. Perfect start for Leibon and Yule, the former world champions. And here's point number six. six one. The Koreans had a very tough first round against the Chinese duo. And they almost struggled. And yesterday they had another three game match against uh, Japanese Sato and Matsuo. But on the other hand, the Danes had a very straight road to the finals. So far they have not <laughs> dropped a single game. Seven, one. And here they continue with their great performance they have shown during the entire week here in Germany. It's 7-1 for Leibon and Jule. Another very well placed smash by Thomas Leibon. Very aggressive start here for from the Danes. Edmonton fans in Europe and of course all over the world, they don't have so many chances to see this 
one of the best European mixed doubles ever, Thomas Leber and Camille Yule, as Thomas has announced his retirement after the London Olympics. So, um, this is one of the last tournaments they will play together. It's 10-1. Perfect start for Denmark. So far, absolutely no chance for the uh, Asian opponents. Very aggressive start. The Danes are getting advices by uh, former world class player Jesper Larsen. And of course, Thomas Leber and Camilla Juhl, they are not only uh, former world champions, they are also European champions in the mixed doubles. And their best world ranking position was number one. Their best results in 2011 was the final of the Bitburger Open and the semi-finals of the Indonesian Open. Twelve one. Another flick serve from Thomas Labon and another brilliant smash from the thirty four year old Dane from Copenhagen. Thirteen one. Brilliant start. the best solution here from Thomas Labour to play backhand from this position but easy mistake from uh, Ha Jung at the net and we have 14-1 I mentioned before Lee Young Day is the current Olympic champion, but they're already number seven in the world rankings. So a very, very strong pair. But it's 214. Now three easy mistakes in a row from the Danes. That give the Koreans the chance to, to get back into this match. But still a 10 points difference here. Ah, brilliant drop from Leon Gay, who's famous for his smooth drops from the rear court. And it seems that the Koreans have found their rhythm. But still a comfortable lead for the Europeans.
And here's point number 15. Let's have a quick look on this schedule on badmintonnew.tv for today. Um, after this mixed doubles finals, we will bring you the women's doubles finals between Huang Xia, Chang Yunhua of China against Jung Kyung On and Kim Ha Na of Korea. Then, probably the match of the day between the home favorite Juliane Schenk of Germany against the Chinese Li Xueri, the number 15, two six. here in the, at the German Open, followed by the men's singles final with the badminton superstar Lin Dan of China, the six. world number two and the top seeded here in th at this tournament against Simon Santos of Indonesia. And the last match of the day will be the men's doubles finals with, again, Lee Yong Day, who qualified for two finals at the German Open, and his partner Jung Jae Sung of Korea against the Chinese unseeded pair of Hong Wei and Chen Ye. This is the schedule of today. You see we have two Europeans left in the competition, and one of this European duo is playing really well at the moment. They are Leading 18-6. Aye. Lee Young Day to serve to Thomas Lebon. Oh, very, very clever stroke from Thomas Lebon. You often see that the Danes are changing their position so that Camilla Eulis is going to the rear court and Thomas Leibon is taking the net. You don't have that so so often in the in the mixed doubles, but here it's really uh, it's really working out because Camilla Martin is able to make a lot of a lot of pressure from the rear court with her her good smash and her good uh, clear. And we have already seen that a couple of times here in this final from the Europeans. And we have game point 28. After only 12 minutes of play. Camilla Yule to serve. A flick serve. Good one. And here it is, Thomas Leibon and Camilla Ewell are taking the first game quite comfortable with 21-9. First game won by Thomas Leibon, Camilla Ritter Ewell, 21-9. It would be the first title for the Danes here in uh, Germany. They have not won this tournament so far. And yesterday Thomas Lebon said that um, he's very satisfied with the results. He and uh, his partner has shown so far, but of course now they're in the finals and now they really want this title. So. Um, 
they are not satisfied with just reaching this finals. Now they really want it. And they want this title here. And it looks really promising. It's important now to, to keep the focus, to, head, to, to make a very good start. That was probably not the best start. And yes, very good service return from Thomas Lebon. Very quick at the net. Stay aggressive. Don't let the Koreans get into this game here. Yes. Here you can see that Thomas Lebon is in the four at the forecourt. He's taking the net. And another very, very well placed stroke from Thomas Lebon. Clever, very clever plates. The Danes have found the gaps, and so far, the Koreans don't have an answer. Lee Young Dae and Ha Jung On had a very good year in 2011 with uh, reaching the semi-finals at the Denmark Open and the semi-finals of the Chinese Taipei Open and they have won the US Open. And in 2012 they uh, were runner-up at the uh, Korea Open, the home tournament. Very good defense by Lee Young Day. He hits the shuttle with a racket frame, so a bit lucky. It's 3 5. Denmark still in the lead. 
Oh, very good. Service return by Thomas Leiburn. And if you have expected that, the current Olympic champion Lee Yong Day will be the man of the match. At the moment, it's definitely Thomas Leiburn who's dictating this game. During the last two years, Thomas Leibon has been injured a couple of times and uh, some serious injuries with his um, knee and I think his, his foot. And so after they became world champions in India in 2009, they struggled a bit. And Camilla Yul was, was concentrating on, on the women's doubles, where she's also a world class player with uh, her partner Christina Pedersen but here at the German Open and they really played well fantastic tournaments and a lucky point for Thomas Leiburn Eight, 8-3 Good drive duel here. Aye. That was a bit too much from Thomas Leiborn. An easy one would, would have been the better option this time. Four, but they are still up with four points. It's 8-4. Oy, very good backhand, cross backhand from Thomas Leibon. Six nine. Ha Jung on to serve to Camilla Yule. Another flick one and another smash from Camilla. I would suggest to uh, to the Korean lady, not to play a flick on Camilla because she's so she's so uh, she's so tall, and she had very very good timing in going into a smash. It's not the best option from the Koreans to play a flick on Camilla Yule. It looks very, very promising uh, from a European point of view. 
after having won the first game, 21-9, Thomas Leibon and Camilla Ewell are now in the lead with 11-7. A few words to the tournament in general. It's a Grand Prix Gold tournament, which offers 120,000 US dollars in prize money. And it's been played in Mülheim an der Ruhr, a small town, a small city close to uh, Düsseldorf. Ooh. Very good defense. And again. Service over. Eight, eleven. Let's see what she's choosing. Which kind of serve she's choosing right now? And a flick another time. And but now she gets it. But Thomas Lebon is so quick at the net. He has seen what what will what come what will come. Easy point for for Thomas. Former world number one duo of Denmark, just seven points away from the tournament win. It would be uh, their first title since 2010. Thomas Lebon. I just wanted to say that Thomas Lebon is so quick, but this time he was not quick enough. No chance to to receive this shuttle from Lee Yong Day. It's 10 14, the Koreans are coming a bit closer now. He is so quick at the net and he's completely controlling it. It's very, very difficult for the opponent's side to serve at Thomas Lebon. Fifteen eleven. Good smash by Lee Yong Day, the 23 year old 12, from Korea, who became Olympic champion with 19 years.
shuttle lands out. 16-12 for Denmark. Five more points to go to take the your next German Open title. The Danes are controlling the net and now are up with 18 12. Quite interesting that the Koreans, they play together in their junior, in their junior time. They've been the best Korean doubles in the junior age groups. But then, after they became the seniors, they they have been splitted up. And now, after a couple of years, they are a pair again. Since 2011. Thirteen, eighteen. Fourteen, eighteen. Let's. Camilla was not ready. And here's again Thomas Leban. Searching the net. Oh. Aye. Camilla Yule hits herself while she tries to receive the uh, the stroke. She's asking for a break. You can imagine that this hurts a lot if anybody of you have tried to. To hit yourself with a, with a racket, it's very, very painful. But she's back with a smile, so um, it's 15-18. Three more points for Denmark. Yes, and here is point number 19. Thomas Leban is going to serve. Two more points. And here is match point. Match point for Thomas Leban and Camilla Ewell. They are serving to take the German Open title in 2012. Thomas Leibon was at the floor. Seven, 
Thomas Levon asked for a break. But the Danes have three more match points. Sixteen twenty, and here it is. Fantastic performance by Thomas Leber and Camilla Yule. Their first tournament title after almost two years. Brilliant performance. Thomas Leber and Camilla Yule. Beat Lee Young Day, Ha Jung on 21 9, 21 16. We will be back with the finals in the women's doubles. See you on badmintonyourup.tv. Match one by Thomas Lebon and Camilla Yule.